Hey guys, uh, Battle Snipe back for another YouTube video slash whatever. Uh, this is just me playing some uh, Infinity Slayer playlist. Uh, I was trying to get like my CSR 50 and everything. Kind of like a little milestone that I decide to go for, I guess. I don't know. There's not really anything to do in Halo because there's nothing to do in Halo. Like, nothing. Like, GT, GTA 5 just came out, and pretty much everyone in my friends list plays that. Um, no one's ever on Halo anymore. They're either Call of Duty, or right now Grand Theft Auto, or I don't know. Anything. I don't know. But, you know, that's how it is, I guess. You know, this is probably the deadest I've seen Halo so far. Like, this playlist probably had 300 people when I was searching it, and... Yeah, it was, it was pretty bad, I have to admit. Like, you don't really see that very often, especially in Halo. But uh, I guess, you know, 343 just managed, you know, to step up their game and really pre performed at this, this game title. Like, they really, they really showed everyone that they knew how to make a Halo game. Yeah. That's sarcasm, by the way. If you did notice. Right here, terrible shots by me. I was like, okay, I gotta not shoot like that again. Start destroying people. Um, this game, I just go like crazy. The guys I was playing with, um, well, I was searching by myself, and, I, and these three guys were, I guess, a party, and they were actually like really nice guys. Like, they were like complimenting me, and they're like, you know, communicating. Even though they didn't really seem to know the callouts, they were, uh, they're at least trying. And you know, you don't get that very often, especially in. Infinity Slayer playlist, it just, it, that's really rare, and I was just like, I think because of these guys, I was doing so well, and they were playing really good Halo for people that weren't, like, competitive tryhards, I don't know if they were or not, but it doesn't, it doesn't matter, but the point is, like, if everyone was like this on the fucking playlist, I would love it, oh my god, it'd be so fun, it'd be like, you know, even without the ranking and everything, it just... The community for Halo, it's just, it's so boring. I don't know. It's just... People are just always telling people they suck, and this and that, and it's just kind of like, okay, man, like... I think we've heard this story, like, since Halo 2, like... On my playing. You suck, you suck, da 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 I think it gets old. Halo 4, you know. Eight years later, I think. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, whatever. This game was, like, pretty cool, pretty fun. Anyways, most of this game, my sniping was really off, but, like, my far BR, look at, like, look at that, okay. This is because I had host, okay? If I didn't have host, I could never do a shot like that, ever, ever perform stuff like that. It's rare. Um,. Like, look, I just lived that. Like, oh my god. But, like, one thing about this game is it was very smart for them to put all these camos on the guns and sh stuff like that, but I find it's kind of too late to add stuff like that. Like, you know, and, and even when the game came out, it had, like, next to no camos, and they were almost all the same. Like, the BR had the yellow stripe thing, and so did the DMR, and so did the... Uh, carbine, and then light rifle. What did the light rifle have? I don't even remember. Had something. Anyways, so and then the BR had a cool one, like a blue one. So the pistol. Like most of them were the same. They looked the same, in my opinion. Um, it's kind of like really. That's how creative you were. You you decided to bring these type of features into Halo and and do a poor job of it. You know, like. They, they wanted to copy Call of Duty, and I don't know if they admit it or not, but this kill's weird. I get a Hail Mary right here. It's pretty funny. I think that guy fell off the map, and it gave me a Hail Mary because the last thing that hit him was my nade. And since he was so far away when it, he died, I got the Hail Mary medal. Anyways, so, back to what I was. It's like, they tried to call, copy Call of Duty, but they kind of did it wrong. Like, they didn't do it right. They, I don't know. They tried to be... Like the whole loadout thing, 
didn't really work. Like, it's it's smart to have it, like, your own custom loadout. So, like, you play game types like this, and I always start with my BR. Always. Like, remember playing, like, Halo 3, and you get, like, that AR star, and it was just, like, you always had to find a BR, and that's the only thing I liked out of this loadout thing. And you always have a secondary, and that's great. Like, they, this was, like, a smart thing. But then they put these perk things where, like, you have shielding and recharge and it's kind of cheap in a way like there's obviously some that are just way overpowering you know like what's the point of having it like right now i think i have shielding and the recharge one that just came out with the championship bundle and that is overpowering because like i get a faster recharge rate so my shields come up faster and while they're recharging they come up faster so like you can get into the action faster like look at that like that's what i mean like my shield recharge so fast and i find that so cheap like in halo that's so cheap like what else can beat that you know like i don't know like you have like the dexterity is great but you just reload faster it's great in situations um same thing with like ammo ammo is great to start off with it just has more ammo but you know, in Halo, you die very often. Like, I know there's times where people don't die, but the majority of the games you play, you probably die every second kill or something like that. Some people just die, so what's the point of having ammo if you're just going to constantly die? But, for, like, mobility... Mobility's one of the most useful ones because you have unlimited sprint. Um, stuff like that. But, I don't know. And armor abilities, like, in a loadout system, was just not smart at all or if they wanted to put that in they could have made it so hey look you get an armor ability but you can only use it once like imagine if the jetpack you didn't have like you had you use your jetpack and it didn't recharge or refill and i think that would be more fair because then you would have to actually think about when to use your jetpack and they can have things where you can like refill like oh, how did i miss that guy anyway like you refill it Anyways, I'm just blabbing out about that stuff, like, it doesn't matter, you know, what's done is done. That guy thought he could outplay me, I guess, I had hosts, I was pretty confident. Another thing is the scene is, like, right now a lot of people are back to Halo 3, I guess, I don't know, the pros are playing that, uh, Ace won the, the $200,000 tournament, free for all, which was nice, I guess, free for all tournament, but... It only really got intense at the end. That's it. Like, I don't know any other time when the, the, the 1v1s were cool. They should have made a 1v1 tournament. Why a free-for-all, you know? 1v1 is more skill-based. It's more like you have to outthink and outplay the other person. Like, they could have made a really good one. And another thing, too, the playlist. Why is there no 1v1 playlist? There hasn't been one since Halo 3. And Halo 3 did a terrible job with head-to-head -head playlist. They had, like, fusion coils everywhere. They had, like four different rockets on one map, they had like beam rifle, sniper, like the weapons and I don't know, they decided to completely change it which made the 1v1 experience on head to head really terribly, like a terrible experience and then they just never had a 1v1 playlist, like I think Halo 4 should have a 1v1 playlist, I think it would be fun, Halo Reach should have had it, I think every Halo should have it, I, I think every game should have it, I guess Call of Duty can't really have it but whatever. I think Halo should have a 1v1 playlist, because you can play 1v1s at Halo. They need a And they have the doubles. Like, they have Sniper, which is great. They have Team Slayer. Stuff like that. But, the other thing they need is the ranking. Uh, I don't know, CSR is just not... It's like, not as satisfying as an actual in-game rank where everyone can see it. And even then, even, e if it's even 1 to 50, or uh, a league thing, like league play, or the way Le uh, League of Legends does it, that's fine with me. As long as they make the seasons like more than just fucking one month. Like, remember Halo Reach, every month there was a new season. That was just lame. It was just like, it, for people that didn't play a lot, it was just like, oh, okay. You know, like, I'm really busy with my life because I have school and everything, so I can't really. This guy was lagging. Oh, it was my host. That's why. But anyways, so yeah, so anyways, next kill wins this. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you enjoyed my little rant while watching this video. If you didn't like it, just mute me, which you can't. But just mute it, and then you won't hear the game sound, but that's fine.
Anyways. Last kill right here, boys. Out BR. And there you have it. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed that video. And uh, hopefully I'll get another video out uh, by at least next week or something like that. But uh, have fun. And enjoy your life.